The blizzard of 77 hit on January 28th, but it was months in the making. We'll start with Lake Erie. Normally, the lake won't freeze over until February, but that winter it was frozen by December 14th because November and December were bitterly cold. Leading up to the storm, the temperature hadn't risen above freezing for 34 straight days. And from the time the lake froze until the blizzard, we got 93 and a half inches of snow. That led to a deep snowpack on top of the frozen lake. Same story in the city. Buffalo had snow for 28 straight days. Leading up to the storm, there was nowhere to put it. So you had tons of snow on the lake, a 37 inch snow depth, piled into the city, and here comes the blizzard. It brought 69 mile an hour wind gusts pushing around all that snow. Our temperature dropped from 26 degrees to zero in just four hours. And here's the worst part. The low pressure system stalled over southern Ontario for three days, and that led to snow drifts as high as 30 feet, despite only 12 inches of snow actually falling from the sky during the entire storm.